you are all having a fantastic day today as always. It's Tuesday? I always get lost on days. I don't know what's wrong with my brain. I can never remember what day it is. Anyway, I think it's Tuesday today. Oh no, it's Wednesday. No, it's Tuesday yesterday. It's Wednesday today and I've had a really busy morning properly spring cleaning every single room of the house. You won't find a single thing out of place in any of the... How many rooms are in this house? Five, six, seven, eight. Whatever, you won't find a single thing out of place in this house and it feels so good. I've also lit candles in most rooms so it smells like Christmas in every single room. But as you can probably tell in here, Jace is getting pretty fed up right now. I've taken him from room to room with me and like occupied him with toys, etc. in each room. Um, I've just put him in his jumper room thinking that's what he wants, he'll definitely make him happy and he's not happy at all. So I'm going to get him out, I'm going to give him some banana and some porridge and then we've got someone coming um, to view the house today. I know lots of you guys have already guessed or seen online because within about three minutes of us listing this house for sale, some of our biggest fans somehow miraculously knew and posted it everywhere online. So <laughs> you guess you guys know that we are selling this house. Um, there is a couple of reasons that we're <laughs> there is a few reasons that we're wanting to sell this house but the main one being that we just want more privacy um when we first bought this house was it about two and a half years ago i think we had about i can't remember how many subscribers maybe 400,000. and as we've grown and grown and grown we've just realized that being on a big open estate like this isn't ideal um and we just want somewhere a little bit more private where when we go home on a night time we know that we can be home and not have people knocking on the door or um, looking through their windows or just driving past and stalking us and looking through the windows or taking pictures outside and all those things that we know is partly our fault that that happens because we weren't careful enough with um, with where we lived but um, yeah we just want somewhere a little bit more private and uh, that's why we're moving but it's probably going to take a while, but this lady that's coming to you today seems very, very, very keen. So we'll see how it goes anyway. We're not in a desperate rush, but yeah, that's that's cleared that one up hopefully for you guys. Anyway, should we go get you some porridge? Should we go get you some porridge and banana? Yeah. What's up, iFam? So coming at you today on one of my skate cameras because unfortunately before I left the house this morning, my camera battery hadn't arrived. So I'm having to make do with this today, which hopefully is gonna be better than my phone because editing my phone footage is just absolutely painful. The audio is so bad. So I'm having to do loads of corrections. It's just taking absolutely ages. So I'm gonna try this today, see if it's any better. I think it's really wide angle, but hopefully it's better than what you've been watching anyway. Today will be the last day that I'm filming on a dodgy camera because my battery is due to be arriving in the next couple of hours via DPD. So fingers crossed that is. My camera's all good, it's not fully broke and we're back to normal, which is what I'm hoping anyway. Anyway, it's a very beautiful morning this morning, as you can see. And I'm out on a skate trip today. We're on a day of filming on the blades and I'm really, really excited because the weather's lovely. The weather's gonna be lovely all day long. And we're just getting packed up. My friend Mark has just met me. He's just gone to get a coffee because he needs a bit of a boost first thing in the morning. And um, we're about to go film some cool stuff in Leeds, hopefully get some good video clips going. Let's say no more and let's get going. So I'm up at B&M because I have a mission for Isabel to do when me and the little two girls are at dancing this evening. She's got a Christmas mission to do. Oh my gosh, I literally cannot wait until my living room looks like this. Woohoo! I'm going to let Isabel fully explain exactly what it is her Christmas mission is that she's doing this evening, but these would be so good for it. So there's this one. <laughs> I can't decide which one to go for. That one, this one. Oh my gosh, oh no. I think that's the music that we're playing Disneyland. Oh my gosh, I think it's gonna have to be that one. Or this one. Oh my gosh, I love them all. I've been all the way. Oh my gosh, I really like that one. Oh, as much as I love the red on this one down here. This is the music that they play in Disneyland um, when we walk through the arcade. Oh, wait a minute, it's playing a different song now. Wait. Oh, wait a minute, I'm really confused. I'm sure that played a different song a minute ago. Oh. 
Okay guys, the red one actually plays the song that I was just talking about. The, oh my gosh, this song makes me feel literally so warm. I know somebody who will be loving this advent calendar at Christmas. Also, I've just seen these which look pretty cool, but there's only 12 days. They've got like bath fizzes in, lip balms, and they're only five pounds, which is quite good. And then also, a really cool looking revolution one. Um, I actually quite want it for myself. <laughs> but I don't think I'm gonna buy myself it because it's 15 pounds and I'm too tight. But I might get it for someone else. It's this revolution. Um, it comes with 60 pounds worth of lipsticks and lip glosses and it looks awesome. So if anyone's looking for a different type of advent calendar this year, then this one looks really good, especially for like teenagers. So after a super quick dash around B&M, because I suddenly realized that because Jace had a long nap this afternoon and we didn't get out till quite late, it was close to when I needed to go and pick Isla up from school. So I went and picked Isla up, then we got home, got her changed into a dance kit, and then I had to rush back out to pick up my big two girls who are now slothing in front of me, well one is, and Esme's upstairs getting herself ready for dance. How excited are you about going back to dance tonight? I, I, well, when I came back, I was really sad because I had three lessons. Two was in bad, because I moved up ballet. What? <laughs> Isla usually does three lessons on a Wednesday, tap, ballet, a modern, modern and then a jazz class on a Saturday. But now that she's moved up a ballet class, her ballet class has been moved to a Saturday as well. So now she only has two classes tonight, which she actually prefers because it's a lot yeah. doing all them hours dancing in, in one go after school. So she's happy and she's very excited to get back, aren't you? Yeah. She's been asking me, when can we go back to swimming and dance? So Ella's very, very excited. Esme's just upstairs. What are you smiling at? Hey, yeah. you play with Isabel. Ah, oh, cutie pie. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready to do your secret mission? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. You alright, Isla? <laughs> so we just sneaked upstairs because Esme and Isla are like, what's going on in here? Why mm -hmm. has everyone been suspicious? Basically, Isabel. Isabel is going to be transforming her sister's bedroom into a Christmas wonderland. A Christmas wonderland. She's got so much stuff. So much here. Place in my bedroom. Oh my gosh, don't show that that. <gasps> Literally have a freak out. <laughs> got so much stuff here. Got window stickers. Free <gasps> my chewing gum out of my mouth. <laughs> I am about to set off and take the girls to dance, so I'm going to be gone a couple of hours. I will leave you in the room. I have to ask Dad to do this because honestly, I know the amount of stress <laughs> that I had doing my How cute though! Oh my gosh, seriously, how oh, did you just cut cute! Me? Oh my gosh, I did. Yeah, I'm so sorry. No, that's, no, go on. No, no. I don't oh gosh, I'm done now. Right, how <laughs> cute is this? <laughs> it doesn't come in so freaking size. It's so lonely though. It's not lonely. Yeah, it's not like it's like leaving its, it's house. Looking for Santa it's like... Isabel. Oh, it's like... Looking for the reindeer. Gosh, children these days. Anyway, I'll leave you in the capable hands of Isabel. She's going to vlog what she's <gasps> yeah. doing, and I'll see you all when we get back to surprise the girls. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited! The first bit of Christmas. <laughs> okay, everyone. I'm just getting myself prepared to start doing the girls' bedroom. Oh my gosh, I'm literally so like excited but a little bit nervous because I don't want to like ruin it. I want it to be really good and really Christmassy and I'm so excited. So all of the stuff that I need is all behind me on the bed. I'm going to go, I think I'm actually going to change real quick. I'm going to quickly change and take all my music upstairs with me, get some Christmas songs going and just set all this Christmas stuff out and make the girls' bedroom a Christmas wonderland. Let's go. Okay, so I just quickly got myself dressed and ready and I was just having a think. I came up to the girls' bedroom and I was just having a think of what I could do. And I was thinking, I have these like snow sheet things, like sparkly, I don't know if you can see, but they're really sparkly and it's snow, like fake snow. Um, and I was thinking if I just like cleared every single like summery bright thing off of here, cleared of Isla's school clothes, don't really appreciate you leaving that Isla. So if I just take away all of this, lay the sheets down, and then I could put like a few decorations and things on here, I think I'm gonna start off by doing that. Okay, so all of that the snow was put down. I'm going to put my torch on just so that you can see the sparkle. Oh my gosh, guys, look at that. You can see it in the light, but on the camera you can't really pick it up, but this is basically what it looks like. Oh my gosh, 
so nice. Okay, so for now I'm going to leave like the set of drawers all sparkly, white and glittery and everything. And I was thinking I need to maybe put something on the on like their desk to make it look really nice and Christmassy. Um, I've just moved pretty much everything off the desk. It was pretty clean to be honest for once. There's this super cute little Santa, reindeer and snowman. It's literally adorable. And so I thought I could sit this in the middle just like this on there and have some like lights or something going around it to make it look really pretty. Um, so I'm going to put this there and maybe get some lights out and do something i'm still like not too sure on what i'm going to do because i've got so it's not even funny how much stuff i've got actually i've got loads of stuff to be putting like everywhere and i've just have no idea guys hopefully this doesn't turn out to be a huge fail yes 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 okay guys i've just won't well, first one no focus i've just realized oh my gosh literally i love this at christmas my favorite thing wait no no actual guys no this is actually not even funny i did not know that this was in this in the bag i'm gonna put you up here i didn't know that this was in the bag but i just checked and it's a christmas bobble that you can like hang up and at the back you can twist it to how many days it is until christmas well let me just work it out it's how many days until christmas 42 oh you have to start this in december wow i'm clever Anyway, what I was looking for in the first place was these stickers at Christmas. I don't know why, but it just makes me bring back like such good memories of like putting stickers on my on my windows. These are the cool like jelly ones. Oh my god, they're the most satisfying things to put on windows ever. Also, guys, sorry about my black fingers. I've got like pen or something on them from doing art today, and I've literally scrubbed it. I scrubbed it in smudges, and it also would not come off. And I've scrubbed my hands, so you have to put it with a little things I'm going to get in the shower and wash that off. So this is what it's looking like guys. I got the snowflakes. I got the Merry Christmas. I've got a really cute snow uh, snowflake snowman. A cute reindeer, some like a like a dove this side and a dove that side. Like as if they're meeting. It's so cute. Some more snowflakes. I'm gonna put the torch on again because the skies look at the sparkle. The sparkle is real. So for the next part of the Christmas Wonderland transformation, I'm going to be putting some of this super cute tinsel around the girls beds it's so sparkly we've got so much sparkle going on it's like overwhelming but at the end of the girls bed on like this bit here i'm gonna wrap around some tinsel so tinsel didn't really go to plan it doesn't really fit and it looks a bit crazy but guys i don't know what to do i'm literally oh, 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 tangled. oh gosh okay so you sort of sorted it made it look even cuter so just like wrapped it around and made it like this so cute! Let's go do it on Isla's. I mean, the girls' room is looking good, but it's not perfect. We've got this going on here. This going on, we've got the window. We've got the tinsel going. But there's just one thing missing, and I know what that one thing is. Is that this place over here is looking extremely, extremely plain. So let's spice it up and get some magic. Okay, I've just blown up this Santa. I literally broke my tooth. It's so sensitive because like um, this like thing that you blow into to put the air into it is rubber, so it's made my tooth go so sensitive. I'm not just sat here like, ugh. But anyway, I've just blew up this amazing Santa with a little present in his hand. It's so cute. I've also got another one of these, but it is a snowman, which I love. And I'm about to just prop these up now, but I've, first of all, I've got to blow up the second one, the snowman. Okay, I've blown the first off. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Oh my gosh, look at these guys. <gasps> these are so cute. Oh my gosh. <gasps> okay, let's pop them up. And then it also, guys, oh my gosh, I need to show you this. The girls are going to freak out because when I saw it, I was like, OMG. So basically, how do I just work? Okay, so watch this, guys. Ready? You can change the song every time it changes. I need to blow them in that spot. It's so cute. OMG, this is looking so nice right now.
right now. I've got the little blow up things on either side. These super cute little sparkly figures, polar bear with like a rabbit and a mouse, and there's a deer with a penguin and a little bird on top. Literally so cute. And of course, we have the big snow globe thing in the middle. I also had a few extra lights, so I put them on here and then down here, switch on. Oh my gosh, the girls are going to love this. And of course, I couldn't do Esme without doing Isla's as well. So I think now I'm going to add a few extra little bits. I've got two like things of white, like snow white tinsel. Um, I've obviously got the amazing bedding, which is so cute. I have to ask Dad to help with that though. I think I'm going to put some of the tinsel like on the window still along there and maybe on the desk as well. It'll look really pretty. And then also the countdown bauble. I'm thinking I'm going to hang that on their door so they can like change it on the morning and things. Oh, I also forgot. I have these as well. They're so cute. They're like, oh, no, I did not know that. I was just thinking, wait, do they have a, and they actually have like a little light in it. Wait, do these, I think it's my batteries already. No, oh, so you need to put batteries in these, but you need to like get a screwdriver, a tiny screwdriver in there and I don't think, oh wait, <gasps> no. And boom, oh my gosh. Okay, let's turn these off now because I don't wanna waste the batteries, but I've got two of them and I'm going to put them next to the little Santa and Rudolph and Snowman. So about, I guess like half an hour later after doing all the beds, getting the girls some like little milk and cookies together, the room is finally done. And I cannot wait for the girls to come home and see this i've just made them these super cute little cup um of strawberry milk and guys <laughs> let me just show you the room everyone the girls are nearly here mommy's like on the boss she's like not giving anything away to the girls and they're about to come in and i actually can't wait for them to see this little wonderland that i've made for them it's actually making me feel quite upset right now i don't know why but i'm like just bringing back memories of christmas and oh my gosh i feel like i'm gonna cry the girls are here oh my gosh i just said that here i'm going to just be sat on their chair and i want to go oh when they walk in. I'm so excited for them to see it. This is the most exciting thing. But like, I was just looking in here, I'm like, oh my gosh, the Christmas tree, everything. And then I walked out to my bedroom and I was like, it's all right. But don't worry guys, I am going to be decorating my bedroom shortly, so don't worry. Wait, they'll be able to hear the music. <laughs> Merry Christmas. December. Do you like it, girls? Yeah. Look, have you seen what's on your desk? Oh my gosh, yay! Thank, Thank you! you. Thank you so <laughs> Merry much. Christmas. Well, Merry pre Christmas. Oh my gosh, this is what I've been doing all night. That's why Mum was being suspicious before. I was like, where, when did you buy all this stuff? Mum bought it. Mum bought it all. I remember. We have to do all of it. Yeah. <laughs> do you have your little things as well? The, like it's a tinsel. Oh, did you see the tinsel on the step? Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, it's nothing. It's the I know, we've got some snowflakes. Oh, whoa. And also, if you go into your bedroom, look on your window. Oh, it's I know. Yes. This is amazing. Thank you. That's okay. Thank you. This is like the this is like the Christmas room. Is this the only one that's decorated? You're going to have, yeah, but you're yeah. going to have to. Yours like the first room, but you're going to have to. Um, watch like a Grinch movie or Home Alone tonight with this cozy. Yeah. Yeah. Music and everything is so nice. Oh, thank you so it's much. It's okay. And your bed, literally, look how cute. So cute. Has you come up to see us? Yeah, Dad's been helping me do like the beds and things like that and clean everything up for you. I know. Well, oh, thank you. it's okay, girl. Yeah. I'm so glad you like it. I was literally like, 
I knew you were going to like it, obviously, and be grateful for it, but I really wanted to make something really special for you all because it's nearly Christmas, girls. Yeah! jealous about your bedding that is the cutest <laughs> bedding i think i've ever seen in my I whole life i think you're jealous of the l lights and the, the cozy the lights tree. oh i'm just I i'm jealous i'm jealous of this whole scene it just looks so cute what's up i fam oh my god look how gorgeous this is right now Whew. lovely it's on a night time at christmas it's so beautiful so i've just left the boys We've done wrapped up on a really, really successful day. It was a lot of fun. I'm so sorry, I can hardly move my legs. I've got like a 10 minute skate back to the car, which I hope is still all right because I put it in some paid parking earlier today and the day has got on way later than I thought it would. But all in good ways. But I think it might cost me a fortune to get it out now. Right, we've just turned off the lights and now it looks even more cute and cozy and Christmassy. I'm so jelly jelly. Jello, jello, jello. <laughs> right, jello. I'm going to leave you beautiful girls to. Oh my gosh, look at this. It looks so cute. Right, I'm going to leave you girls. <laughs> Maui. <laughs> I'm going to leave you girls. Get your pajamas on, okay? And put a Christmas, Christmas movie on. Christmas Eve. Christmas Eve. So I think we're going to end the vlog here, but before we do, I've surprised Chris for my birthday and he doesn't know about it and he can't hear me but I've booked something for my birthday that I'm so excited about babe come here I've got a surprise for you today's all about the surprises I don't know if you're gonna like this surprise I've booked my birthday treat whenever I use Chris's card he always, ch he always checks <laughs> I did that text did you get that is that how much it was every time someone goes up my bank I get a text we well, need to turn that off because that's not fair. I feel like you're spying on me. I'm spying on you. Why do you think I got it on? <laughs> <laughs> I'll keep a track of what you're spending full. <laughs> it's because it came through with a one time password because it felt yeah, it did. fraudulent. Yes, transaction. it did actually. Yeah, it did. Because it said, um, please enter this passcode when I tried to pay because it was a high amount of money. And then the passcode went to the number that's on the, on the card, the credit card, the debit card, oh, which is Chris's phone. Anyway, he didn't know what it's for, but I'm about to tell you. Are you excited? No, I'm nervous. Guess where we're going on my birthday? Friday the 13th, my birthday. Oh God. We're going to Manchester. <coughs> to... Oh no, I can't do this while Jace is crying. <laughs> Chris just said it better not be to Celine Dion because we've already got tickets to that. I don't worry, I won't say what you actually said. <laughs> there might have been a swear word in there. <laughs> anyway, we're going to Manchester. Are you ready for this? Come and sit down because I need to see your face. No, I've got the the, I've, yeah, you've got male appearance. We're not a bit of that. <laughs> We're going to the theatre. We're going to see The Grinch Who Stole Christmas. <laughs> going to see The Grinch Who Stole Christmas. I've got crap. Ouch. <laughs> Are you buzzing? <laughs> I'm yeah, so I'm buzzing. Good. No, I'll be really good to your face. That's really I cool. wish you could see Chris's face right now. Is that his? No, I'm not. I'm cool, man. That'll be fun. That'll be really good. Won't it? Yeah, That'll be so much fun. I can't... Here. We'll have to get a nice hotel for that night. We're not coming home after a theatre. We'll have to get a hotel. Oh, yeah, a nice swanky one. Swanky my birthday. hotel for your birthday. Go out for a nice swanky <laughs> meal. Definitely. Make a swanky night of it. <laughs> I can't wait. I'm honestly so excited. I absolutely love the theatre. It's one of my favourite things to do. And I can't think of a better way to spend my birthday than going and seeing a, a proper Christmas show. I'm so, oh, oh my gosh, I'm literally so excited. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you back here tomorrow at 5pm. Good night, fam. Mwah.